So, where are we going today? We are going to our new place. And then we are going to do the puppet, the open door ceremony. Just feed the lizard for a few days already. When you get a new key from HDB, right, you'll come in like a very beautiful mm -hmm. bag. Yes. Oh, look at ours. Ta da! <laughs> nah. <laughs> this is so beautiful. I am speechless. Yeah, we have to test out the keys and find out which key belongs to which room. Mm -hmm. The aircon is new and good, it's working very well. The floor condition is not bad, it's just that there are some rust and some scratches that we cannot remove. We are keeping this tea console, we are only changing the laminates on the wall here. As you can see, there is lines already. Now we move on to the kitchen. I plan to change the switches. This is the, the fan that comes with it, it's called Eco Air. Kitchen-wise, we are planning to redo the whole kitchen because this theme is a bit too dark for our taste. Oh yeah. <laughs> so some of the mechanisms inside are very simple. Just press the button and then it will turn on and off. Then the fan is just like a little For those of you who don't know, when you build a kitchen, right? Usually you will just get a casement door. But then you have to pay extra if you want to get a drawer. So for ours, they are charging about $90. Per drawer. Lucky for us, I think the current house has already six drawers, five here and one over there. Oh, seven drawers, sorry. This is actually like a sauce rack. For the casement door hinges, we are also reusing some of them because um, they are still really new. La. This is the common toilet. We have the storage heater. Water is working well. And here we have shower head and toilet bowl. Right, they actually went through HIP. So the toilets are really relatively new and well maintained. And this is the master room toilet. They actually changed the doors. It's really, really, really small. It's tiny. Wherever needs to is right on the shower. And actually, you can see the wall is really, very clean. You see the grouts are still white. We are choosing like ice cream towels. Initially, we just want to do this part of the wall, but then uh, ID has given us a very good suggestion which is to tell the bottom part of the toilet instead because I want to cover this flower, 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 flower. So we're gonna have some beautiful towels at the bottom here. Now we have exited the master bedroom toilet and enter the master bedroom. So as you can see... We have now the wall between the master bedroom and the common room next to it. I didn't like the idea of knocking down the walls initially because it degrades the value of the house, but then Eventually, I learned to love the place because of the surroundings. And the house is not just the, about the interior but also the exterior. 
I think we'll just leave it this way. We won't be sealing up the master bedroom and the common room. Yay! And the lights are working fine and good because I paid the electricity fee. Woohoo! <laughs> so the curtain check was done. We're just gonna, we're gonna on this side as well. We're just going to have to bring the Okay, so the lights here are working as well. I like this switch. The previous owner actually customized this wardrobe and they decided to keep it because I think it's quite nice. Usually the original door is here and here, right? But now they seal it up and then they open the door here. It actually blocks the airflow for us. Really, really like bright and windy area. So, look, look. Okay, you feel the wind. One of the things in the plan is we are going to punch through this wall to just allow the wind to go through the walls. Hi guys, so we are downstairs and just finished lunch. Now we are going to try the letterbox. Hi, Jimmy. <laughs> Today marks the end of our first day back in our new house. See you in the next video. Bye!